I know that we just met, but if Prince Harry trusted me with his life, then I think you can too. Well, I do feel better having a lawyer in the room. Oh my God, you're so cute. Um, I'm not a lawyer, but I am glad that my fashion pony is working. Oh, oh hi. I'm Wendy Kurtz. Welcome to Blouse Barn. Lisa Chung. I didn't realize there were gonna be more of us. We're her representation. David Rose. Angelica Bloomfields of Rose, Bloomfield, and Glickman. Well, let's go to my office, shall we? This shouldn't take long. The check. This should cover the cost of the signs, business cards. About that check. Uh, uh, we had some questions about the amount. Well, you shouldn't. $10,000 is the amount we agreed upon. Well, that may be, but some things have changed on our side, and we want to discuss the... I think it's fine, David. From a legal standpoint, there are lots of costs to consider. Mm -hmm. There are the signs and the business cards. I just mentioned those. Objection sustained. There is the travel. There are the meals. There is the shipping and the catering. Which is very similar to the meals and not necessarily relevant, so... Well, the $10,000 doesn't even cover our legal fees. What? No, so, don't worry about that. And if we're gonna announce a new name, there has to be a whole relaunch event, and that involves event planners and um, florists. Okay, I think and, what like, my colleague is trying to say is that our brand is very well established here, um, so we're going to require a higher compensation. Okay, well, Blouse Barn Australia is willing to offer you an additional $5,000. Oh my God, thank you. So if you'll just sign here, I think we're good. I don't think we are. I have done some research and I happen to know that your company pulled in $100 million last year. Point being? Well, point is, judging by your bag and those shoes, Blouse Barn Australia is paying you quite a bit of money to come here and help us switch over our signs. Bottom line, we're standing in your way, and I don't think your client will be very happy if you come home without securing the rights to the name, especially considering you're expanding into 78 stores across North America, and let's be honest, Blouse House doesn't have quite the same ring to it. Exactly. Angelica, please. This is the number that we are after. Now, if you'll excuse us, we have another meeting to get to. We're in our store. We await your reply. David, come on in. Here, have a seat. Lisa got back to me. She dropped off a check. Uh -huh. It's a big check, David. Oh, thank God. It's a big fucking check! Oh. <laughs> um. <laughs> You don't mean one of those big lottery checks, right? Okay. No. Okay. But you pulled it off. Um, thank you for trusting me. Well, I wouldn't go that far. Okay. Um, I guess we should get back to work then. I love your enthusiasm, but I think I'm gonna take some time for my family, for me, and close the store. Oh, okay. But I appreciate all you've done, and I want you to have this. You and Alexis. Oh, Alexis didn't do that much. Oh, oh my God. And I hope this helps get you on your feet and do something interesting. You always do. Uh, I can't accept this. <laughs> 